Hello and welcome to another video walk around with myself, Elisa, here at Toyota Northwest Edmonton. And today we'll be taking a look at this 2012 Mazda 5 GS. So this is a four-door, six-passenger wagon in a liquid silver metallic color. Under the hood, you'll find a 2.5-liter inline four-cylinder engine, and you'll be riding on top of 16-inch alloy wheels. Now, some of your features include your rain-sensing wipers. You have fully automatic headlights and remote keyless entry, but there's a ton happening on the inside as well, so why don't we hop on in and take a look around. Helping you into your Mazda is this handy dandy fob with flip key. On your fob you have your lock, your unlock and your panic button. Pushing the unlock button once unlocks the front doors and pushing it twice unlocks all four. And we're just gonna open this up here. We'll take a look at some of the features and the space that we have inside. So right away you can see there's tons of room. You do have your power windows, locks and mirrors. You also have your all weather floor mats to keep your vehicle nice and clean. And you have these really comfortable seats. Now you do have the bucket seats in the back as well. I'll just open this up here for you quickly so you can see. So you've got that sliding door and you have those two bucket seats uh, with the armrests as well with those two bench seats in the back that holds a total of six passengers. So we're just gonna hop on in here. We will take a look at the odometer, start it up here for you. All right, so there we go. Now taking a look at the odometer, there's 116,969 kilometers that it reads there. Moving a little bit further back onto the steering wheel here, you can see that you do have all of your mounted controls that you're going to want. You have your volume control and your mode changer. You also have your voice command and you have your hands-free calling there, which is gonna make it much safer uh, to keep your hands on the wheel and stay connected. You do have your cruise control here on the right-hand side for all of you highway drivers. Now, all of your information is going to be at the top of the screen there. So you're going to see your music playing. You're going to see your temperature gauge and your clock and everything like that. So moving into the entertainment system, you do have everything you're going to want. You have your CD player, you have your AM FM radio, and you have your Sirius XM radio. You also have the ability to plug in your phone, which gives you your Bluetooth and your hands-free calling as well. Now, uh, you do have your air conditioning, which is going to be really nice in the summer months there's the air conditioning right there so that's going to be really handy for you and moving a little bit further down you do have your manual mode if that's how you'd prefer to drive that's going to be really really fun if that's uh, what you'd like to do moving a little bit further down just right here you have your 12 volt dc plug-in and your audio input your mp3 player there if that's how you'd prefer to play your music that's going to be great for you and we do have the two cup holders and you have these really great armrests that's going to be nice uh, for those long trips when you want to put your arms somewhere and get them out of the way. Moving into the glove box now, you do have all of the manuals that you're going to need in case you need a little bit more information about your vehicle. And you have that great little cutout there that can hold some smaller items as well. So lots of really great stuff happening in the front of your Mazda. Why don't we head on back and take a look at cargo. Taking a look at the back of your Mazda 5, now you can see that you do have a rear windshield wiper for that unpredictable Alberta weather. And I'm just gonna open this up here and we're gonna take a look at the cargo space. Now love this setup because you have a little bit of cargo space in the back with those seats up. Right under here, you do have an, a separate compartment holding all of your, your tools for your spare tire, which is just under there as well. And a smaller compartment there holds um, some smaller items that you don't want rolling around the back. That's gonna be nice for you. And then we're gonna set these down so you can see just how much cargo space you have with the seats down and it's really easy. I can put them down with one hand and film at the same time. Uh, this is great for people who like going on road trips or uh, if you have a little bit of equipment to carry around with you. So tons of cargo space with those seats folded flat. And when you're done loading up all your gear, easy to close. And there's a view of the back of your Mazda 5. Giving you a final look then of your 2012 Mazda 5 GS. You can see those windows in the back are tinted to give your cargo and your passengers a bit of privacy. And there's lots happening that I didn't get a chance to go around in this brief walk around. So come on in, take it for a test drive, see how it fits in with your lifestyle. We are very easy to find. We're on the corner of 137th Avenue and St. Albert Trail. We're here at Toyota Northwest Edmonton. My name is Elisa. Thank you so much for watching this walk around. And until we see you, drive safe.